everybody, welcome to GameCube. I'm Jeff Keeley, and right now I'm inside the Gamefly warehouse where I'm surrounded by more games than you've seen in your entire life. I'm here to help you pick through all these new releases and decide how to fill up your GameCube. What do Aerosmith, Ninjas, and Lego have in common? Well, they're all featured in brand new releases for the month of June. Here's our picks for the hottest new games. We call it Cue 'em Up. <laughs> Indy's back and looking rather small and plastic in LEGO Indiana Jones. Similar to LEGO Star Wars, this game follows the plots of the first three Indy films in stackable detail. You can unlock over 60 playable characters, use the whip to your heart's content, but look out for snakes. Why did it have to be snakes? Ah! Here we go! Speaking of snakes, famous developer Hideo Kojima is taking the wraps off the latest installment in his hugely popular Metal Gear series, with this the fourth installment, Guns of the Patriots. Solid Snake is back and older this time, ensconced in the politically unpredictable mercenary world of the Middle East. It's a PlayStation 3 exclusive. Jason Bourne's adventure continues in The Bourne Conspiracy. You play as the CIA-trained assassin, propelled through scenes and challenges ripped right out of the movies. You skid through the streets of Paris in a tiny mini, sneak through the embassy in Zurich, and get into endless and engaging fistfights. Hand-to-hand -hand combat is encouraged, and you'll be rewarded with the sound of countless breaking bones. <laughs> If you don't want to miss a thing, check out Guitar Hero Aerosmith. It's the latest update to the hugely popular Guitar Hero franchise. While the gameplay is pretty similar to Guitar Hero 3, this game is all about the bad boys from Boston and some special guest stars. Play through career mode and you'll feel like a member of the band with less spandex and scarves. Finally, Ninja games never get old, and Ninja Gaiden 2 is no exception. Someone kill that damn ninja! The series gave some great ninja action to the first generation Xbox, and this game for the 360 keeps the tradition going strong. The action is fluid and smooth, and the characters, including some buxom beauties, have never looked better. Life shall spill, and you shall die! That's a look at the top games that are coming out this month. Let's check out the games you should be playing right now in a segment we call Head of the Queue. We start the countdown with Call of Duty 4 Modern Warfare at number five. Another sequel, Tom Clancy's Rainbow Six Vegas 2, infiltrates the fourth slot. For a little family-appropriate fare, Mario Kart Wii power slides into number three. Bad idea, man. Shut the hell up. Number two is Army of Two, EA's co-op action game. And the top rental for May? Once again, Rockstar rules the charts with Grand Theft Auto 4. And that's the top five games right now at Gamefly.com. <laughs> This show is not a one-way conversation. We want to hear from you, so it's time for our FAQ. Toby Cato writes in and asks, is it true that the new Star Wars game coming to the Wii will allow you to use the Wiimote as a lightsaber? Smart you are, Toby. Well, last year's LEGO Star Wars The Complete Saga gave you some Wiimote saber abilities. The Force Unleashed, due on September 16th, lets you participate in a Wii Duel mode where you wield your Wii Remote to slash and slice. There are over 25 playable characters, including Luke Skywalker, Darth Maul, and yes, of course, the Sith Lord himself. If you have a question, send it right now to GameQ at Gamefly.com. If we use your question on the show, well, that just means you're cool. That's it for this time on GameQ, but for all the folks here at Gamefly, I'm Jeff Keeley. Until next time, remember, keep that queue full. Welcome to the GameQ. The hottest new releases that y'all 
hustle plays Cause there's nothing worse than getting a bad 